Good morning, St. Pius. I'm Meredith Wilson. And I'm Josie Guadiano. And, and you're, you're watching, watching The X Factor. X Factor. We have all your news for today, so get your planner out and stay tuned. The Bible quote of the day is from Psalm 147:11. The Lord delights those who fear Him, who put their hope in His unfailing love. Lunch today is cheeseburger. Happy birthday today to Anna McKellar. Happy birthday. Now let's go over to Grace with sports. Thank you. Congratulations to the girls basketball team for winning districts this past Saturday. Also, congratulations to Natalie Denzer on scoring her 1,000th point against Platte County. The girls play sectionals tonight at Liberty North at 8 p.m. versus Chillicothe. Everyone, please come out and support the Lady Warriors because they only have one more game after this until state. That's all for sports. Now back to you. Thank you, Grace. Seniors, please bring or email five to ten baby pictures or friend pictures to Grace Gingler or Hannah Lee for the senior video by Wednesday if they are hard copies or by Friday if you are emailing them. North Kansas City Hospital is accepting applications for summer youth volunteers, so if interested, contact them. The annual dodgeball tournament is coming up on March 16th, so if you are interested in playing, sign up in Miss Smith's room. It is $5 per team member and each team can have seven members on it. It can be all boys, all girls, or be a co-ed team. Wow, that is awesome. Another thing like that coming up is the 3-on-3 three -three March Madness Basketball Tournament. That is on March 17th at 10 p.m. And if you want to come to watch, it is $5 or a gently used pair of shoes. If you are wanting to play, sign up in Miss Camino's room. It is $5 per person. Donnelly College is here today, so see Mr. Murphy if interested. Also, activities for the St. Joseph's Table will begin Monday, March 13th, up until the 17th, so keep watching this week for more information on that. The Scholar Bowl team competed Saturday in the West Central Conference Academic Bowl and had five wins with no losses. Good morning, St. Pius. This is Jack Muirhead We're here with an update about the convent. The convent is just about complete. Art has moved in, and the music room and broadcast journalism rooms are almost finished. All we are waiting on currently is a stable internet. Now here's a little more about the art room from Mark Smith. I think the new art room is really nice, very spacious, and it has its own sections for uh, everything from paint to pastels, colored pencils. Uh, it's really organized actually, a lot more spacious than the previous room. And of course, what we've all been waiting for, the outdoor classrooms should be complete in the next two weeks. That's all for today, St. Pius. Have a good day. Back to you. Matthew Kirk came in sixth place, Grace Ross came in third, and Rosemary Sherian came in first. Congrats to them. Now let's hear a little about the convent. Very cool. I'm very excited for us to move over there. I'm also excited for today's Tuesdays with Nolan. <laughs> Did you know that apple seeds can be poisonous? Tuesdays with Nolan. Wow. Well, that is all the news for today. Be sure to tune in tomorrow and, and have, have a, a great, great day, St. Pius. Pius. <laughs> <laughs>